Hello. It is I. The guy with the numbers in his name. That's like most usernames though, if you think about it. Damn, somebody driving a loud car. What's up everyone, we're here. To where we a stream. To where we are, but it's raining boulders stream. Let's get it. Let's get it. Oh, as you can see, there's a new donation goal. Help fund the next big terrarium video. It's not even that big. That's not even that big of a goal. But if anyone ever wants to help out with that, there you go. You have the option. If not, it'll probably take longer for this certain video that I have planned to come up. But let's hop into it. Uh, I swear it sounds so quiet. It's either I'm loud or the game's quiet. I think the game's quiet. I'm gonna turn up the game to like 60. I'm feeling like a 60, maybe a 65 is good. Let's do like a 65. I think a 65 is good. All right, mods, boom. Enabled mods. There you go. That's all you need to see. Main mod. Boulder Rain. Shout out the creator of this. Exactly what I wanted. Raining boulders. So yeah, this is a mod that adds raining boulders. There's different types of boulders. It's cool. It's cool. I have customized it. So that. Uh, not only we get different types of boulders, we get a lot of boulders, pretty much non-stop boulders, but they do less damage. Uh, no, we're going to keep tile collision on. I feel like that's going to keep us safe. <laughs> the boss we have to kill today is from the QWERTY's mod, and it's in the ice biome underground ice biome, I believe. It's that polar bear boss. Let's do it. New character. New character. All right, let's see here. Go ahead, randomize. Boom. No. Boom. No. Boom. That's what I'm feeling. Raining boulders. I'm going to name him. Uh, what's the name of that dude? Was it from Jimmy Neutron? Bulby? Was that his name? How do you spell that? <laughs> Jimmy Neutron. B-O-L-B-I. Bulby. That's how you spell his name. <laughs> Bulby. There we go. Any hints to what that video is? It just requires some physical objects. You see the goal in the bottom right here. It just requires some physical objects. Most Terraria videos don't require a physical object, but this one specifically requires a couple. Uh, all right, Bulby. New world. Make it small. Make it normal. Boulder rain. Simple as that. Make it one word. Boulder rain. Boulder rain. That was not a face cam video. I own a face cam. You reckon the boulders can hurt bosses? The boss is located underground. See what I did there? I actually thought about it. So I'm assuming above ground is going to be hell. Underground is going to be fine. I don't know. We'll see. Maybe it is hell. Both. Up. Right, this might be a little bit harder than I thought. I didn't think it was going to be this crazy. Use our iframes. Maybe we can get to a cave. <laughs> There's no way. There's no way. There's no way we're getting anywhere, bro. 
I didn't think it was gonna be this crazy. <laughs> take down, take down. I don't have like instant respawn either, so. Why'd they put me next to a tree? Who this? Your spawn gets moved every time. You know that, right? You ever played Terraria before? <laughs> put this like, dig down, dig down, dig down as soon as he spawn, dig down. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have to tweak it. <laughs> the rain is a little too chaotic. It's a lot more chaotic than I thought it was gonna be. We'll do this one. Boulder Hell. Enables Boulder Hell mode, which increases Boulder spawn rates, Boulder damage, and makes the Boulder Rain event occur. Okay, see, we want less damage. Lowers the amount of damage done. Oh, bullshit, lowers the amount of damage done. <laughs> okay, let's try that one. Hopefully, I don't have to make a new world. <laughs> this does not feel like this is slower. Well, actually, it does. But I still can't move. Oh, dodging. Oh, the damage is too high. I think we have to just do the regular default one because like I legit cannot get out of here <gasps> if I just don't get hit directly by one do I no I don't think it's possible for me to get out of here without getting hit I couldn't even leave the game. Why is my K button not working? No, it is working. Alright, we go to the lowest option. <laughs> Enables Boulder Frenzy Mode, which increased Boulder Spawn Rates. See, the original, like, description was like, it has a 10% chance to occur every day. That sounds so boring. I want it raining non-stop, but like doable rain. You know what I'm saying? See, now this isn't f as fun. <laughs> oh, shit. I should not throw that away. I actually threw away the echo log. Give me that back. Thank you. Uh, finish your mission. What's the mission? Life crystal. See, like, look at this. There's no boulder. <laughs> Ow, fuck. I don't know how I still, like, hit my microphone. It's been in front of me for, like, years. I guess we could build us a starting area, but like, we're gonna be underground like 90% of the stream. Now. Do it so they deal less damage. Putus, what do you want me to do? You want me to fucking code the mod, bruh? <laughs> Do it so they do less damage. I, I don't know how to cope. <laughs> That's not an option in the config. You saw the options. There were six of them. We just went over like four of them. Okay, there goes. This is my starting home.
We'll go back to Rocky Wrath. Now I think we'll do Rocky Wrath and we take off mix and match. What the fuck? I didn't even spawn inside of my house. <laughs> Watch it. This respawn will put me in the house. Right? This respawn will put me in the house. It didn't put me in the house. This respawn will put me in the house. Right? <laughs> Dude, it's literally impossible to get inside of here. I'll get inside of here. This is the challenge right here. If I get inside this house, we win the challenge. Fuck the boss. We're not even fighting the boss. <laughs> We're getting inside this house. Perfect. Here, go ahead. Spawn in a bed. This is our spawn now. Let's see about spawning in things. Let me get like a vanity set on, you know? Let me pimp my character out. Gotta look cool. If I'm gonna die 24 7, let me at least look cool. Let me at least look cool. Let's see here. Where's the Lorax at? Oh, I don't have Thorium installed. It can't be the Lorax. <laughs> Alright, let me be a Ninja Turtle. There you go. You know, Halloween is around the corner. <laughs> you guys are, like, so unfunny with your jokes. <laughs> I can get everyone to laugh saying balls in your jaws and you guys are like cheating again. Come on. If balls in your jaws can get you guys to laugh, but you guys use the same joke over and over, y'all need to step it up, man. Your viewers are 12. I don't know what's up with you, Glitch. You're always like an asshole 24-7. You came in here and immediately like banned someone. So like four messages some dude typed a message you like how old are you like shut your ass up boy balls in your scalp see look at least you changed it up the dude typed four messages bro <laughs> you're a fucking officer officer of the law you think that like banning people on discord and shit like gets you like points or something Shut your ass up. I know how you are, Glitch. I've fucking known you for fucking years at this point, bro. <laughs> Little goofy ass boy. Alright, let's get to it, though. We're underground. We could constantly hear boulders. Now, my question is, if I turned off boulder collision, would the boulders fucking come down here? Because I'm assuming that's what taking off the collision was saying. I actually kind of want to see. This might be a bad thing or it might be a good thing. Good as in like funny. Good for content. Why? It didn't spawn me in my house. <laughs> See, this is terrible. <laughs> this is terrible. <laughs> this is even worse. But it's kind of funny. Why the fuck does this not put me in the house? Is it because there's no like floor in the house? Ooh, ooh. Y'all saw y'all seen the dodges for a second though, right? Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh shit. I need to put some platforms in this hole before I fall into it like 30 times. It's putting me further and further outside. Wait! I got like two boulders or two platforms down before the boulders got me. <laughs> I 
guys let me work on this shit. <laughs> it's like... I don't know how many times the mod dev updated this mod, but like, did he like think about like how this shit works? <laughs> There's no way he made this mod. Maybe he just thought about it with like the 10% thing, but like that's so boring. He wants to play like, oh, there's a 10% chance that boulders are gonna rain every day. They are only doing 20 a hit, but there's so fucking many. <laughs> I can't reach that crafting workbench. It's too high. It's too high. This just seems annoying. Were you not here for the last stream I did? Y'all see adversity in your way, and you're like, this is annoying. I don't want to play anymore. <laughs> see, that's the problem with our newest generation of the youngins. <laughs> they see adversity, and they're like, I don't want to play this anymore. I'm playing something else. Too hard. The last stream was arguably worse. Honestly, this wasn't that bad until I made it go through the floor. I, there needs to be like an option like in between. Oh, 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 <laughs> It's like, how long can I fucking juke, bro? <laughs> Did you make it so the umbrella protects you? At least I spawn inside the house. Maybe there's like more options. No, there isn't more options. <laughs> there's like nothing else to click on. I, I like the idea of different types of boulders. That's pretty cool. But it's like... Wait, what? I have Rocky Wrath on. Okay, I was about to say, I was like, what? Because I feel like it increases boulder spawners. I feel like if it's not on 24-7, like, it's, it's not a challenge. <laughs> oh. See, like, this is doable. This is doable. Oh. If it's, like, this slow, kind of doable. See, like, if I'm randomly in a cave and I just get hit by a fucking <laughs> kind of doable. But then there's, like, no boulders. It's like, this is not a challenge. I don't want to do this then. Come on, where the boulders at? Hit me with some boulder rain. Is there, like, a mod from the item? No, there's, like, nothing. We'll give it a while. If I start, if it starts like raining boulders and I start getting hit, then I think that'd be pretty funny. But like, if there's no boulders at all, I don't want to do this challenge. It's boring. <laughs> I'd rather die over and over again than have this. Yo, we're in the ice caves already. Oh, what the fuck? Is your chest over here? What the fuck? <laughs> How did we even spot that? Was it the boulders? The boulders <laughs> revealed the uh, ice chest. But yeah, for people that think this is like a terrible hard challenge, you guys, were you guys at the last stream? <laughs> Where I fucking died like literally the whole entire stream. Like, even that one, I couldn't even get out of spawn. Literally, the Stardust 
pillar spawned in spawn and I couldn't leave. The fire ones revealed it. Uh, I don't know. I, I have to find a way to contact this developer. I feel like this mod is very close to greatness. Because, like, who wants it as, like, a random event, you know? Who wants it as, like, a random event that can have a 10% chance to occur, occur every day? People are going to use it like how I'm using it, as a challenge. And then, like, the two other options, it just rains nonstop, so you can't even move. Like, does he expect you to have, like, 400 health when you spawn in? Got a blizzard in a bottle. It's actually amazing. What if I give myself 400 health and then we walk around like that? I feel like the, the boss part of the challenge would be too easy then. What are you talking about? That was that shit called crowd control? I do want to do crowd control again. At some point. I'm over here mining tin. Who does this? Still no rain. Very sad. Very boring challenge with no rain. I probably should have added like something else to this. This is upsetting. No, they don't only spawn in the surface layer. They literally can go through the floor. This dude feels tanky. Or does this so... Oh, it's annoying. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Funny. <laughs> you know what's funny? So, remember how I was talking about it during the uh, summoner stream if you're here? I was like, every time I post a Terraria challenge video, everybody's always like, Ooh, do a series on this. So we posted two Terraria challenge videos in a row and all the comments in both videos are like, Ooh, do a series. It's like, bro, you should do a series on this. Like, do these motherfuckers not understand? <laughs> See, like, if this doesn't prove that I have terrible RNG, like, What, I spawn with a garbage sword and then I make a new sword and it's also garbage. This is just like the clicker class <laughs> When I made like three clickers and they were all ass Yeah, the boulders stop the bowl the boulders have a chance to spawn with the option that we chose But then the other two options they rain non-stop and they do too much damage. It's like there's no in between, you know? Which kind of sucks. Enables boulder frenzy mode, which increases boulder spawn rates. There's hell mode. Well, like, I don't like that hell mode increases the damage. What if we do this? Can I enable like two at once? Bruh, <laughs> this is probably a bad idea. While I'm at it, enable this. <laughs> now, I don't want to do a quote-unquote series with the wheelchair stuff. I do want to do more videos of the wheelchair thing. But the thing is, I want them to add damage when you throw the wheelchair. Like, does that not make sense? If I throw a wheelchair at somebody, they're going to take damage. Like, that shit applies to real life. Ooh, that might be a thing, Catrubus. I don't think boulders are uh, considered enemies, though. You know how, like, some projectiles are considered enemies? I don't think boulders are, so that... Hey, I should turn collision off. I don't know why I turned collision back on. <laughs> You see the speed? See how fast I hit that?
Now I wonder if any of the explosive ones are gonna get through the little hole in my house. What if I go outside with an umbrella? <clears throat> Where's my wheelchair at? So there's a pinwheel wheelchair. You can carry town NPCs. That's what they added in. <laughs> I saw that they updated the mod and that's what they added in. Now the challenge just got harder. I'm in a wheelchair. Oh, I'm spawning outside now. No, I fucked up. What are you even talking about, Buddhist? <laughs> See, I like how the boulders can like come into my house, bro. But yeah, I think we have to take an L on this challenge, not because like. Uh, I took a loss like fighting the boss or the boss is too hard. It's just not possible to have Like a lot of boulders or not even a lot of boulders to have the amount of boulders. I want and do this challenge <laughs> Obviously, this is not the amount of boulders. I want raining 24 7, but I want like a light rain of boulders 24 7 While I'm trying to do stuff on the surface even underground is that a pyramid even underground. So I, I just can't, I can't do this challenge. Legally not allowed to, okay, maybe not legally, not allowed to do this challenge. Just because it's not gonna work how I want it to work. Which kind of sucks. They need to add in a few more tweakable settings yeah I, I agree with that because it's like I, I don't know what they expect <laughs> if you're doing this as a challenge nobody's gonna start the challenge with full armor and 400 health so that they can survive a hit from the boulder shit they might not even survive a hit from the boulder <laughs> some of those boulders are doing 700 damage in fucking the hell mode I do want to see something though We'll see how this wheelchair works with the NPCs. Come here. Get in. Where is he? Get in. <laughs> this is going to be the next video. We have to protect the NPC from dying. Does he regen? He does regen, okay. <laughs> that could be the next one though. I wonder how this works in multiplayer with the uh, NPC. Like can me and Ryan like toss them between each other? <laughs> I'll be like, hey, catch! And he catches them. And then say like a mob is coming towards him, throws them back to me. <laughs> But like, look, if I throw a fucking NPC at a damn eyeball, it should take damage, not the person in the chair. It should be like a mount. It would make it so much more fun. And then I definitely think they should add like variants of the wheelchair. Imagine like a wheelchair with like a mini gun on the side. Of it. <laughs> like an auto turret on it. That'd be fucking hilarious. Let's see. I think I can only have one NPC at a wheelchair at a time. Cause I can't take I can't equip another wheelchair. 
I can equip this wheelchair. <laughs> Are here a wheelchair basket? We can play basketball with them. <laughs> I want to see something with the wheelchair rain. Or not the wheelchair rain. What if it rained wheelchairs? <laughs> I want to see something with the boulder rain. Somebody brought up a good point. Someone said, can your bosses survive boulder rain? Oh, I'm kind of interested. <laughs> kind of interested. What if I were to, you know, let it rain a little bit? This should not take this long to load fucking like 10 mods, bro. Especially on that SSD. Oh, they're not doing full damage because I have the wrong settings enabled. Mods. Let's take Rocky Wrath off. There you go. Now they should be doing like max damage. But they're not spawning. What the hell? <laughs> they're not spawning, so I, I can't tell. I can't test it. <laughs> This is the boss we were gonna fight, by the way. Can I put you in a wheelchair? You wanna get in a wheelchair? <laughs> Come here, get in my wheelchair. The quality literally dies when boulders come on stream. This is usually how bitrate works. Hey! 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 Kind of mods are on the mod browsers. You guys want to see how I choose a video? I feel like I've shown this all before. Let's see how I try and choose a video. Look at the mod browser, and then I don't see anything interesting, so then I don't do a video. That's how it usually goes. <laughs> all right, fucker, we're changing it up here, okay? I wanted to save this for something, but fuck it, but fuck it, I'm doing it, I'm doing it right now, where's my control at, this is what we're doing, we're gonna do a video that I've been wanting to do for a while, or redo for a while is what I should say. I'm going to take the donation thing off. Why do I look like that? What is that? Why, what do I look like? <laughs> Why do I look like a fucking squid? I got to turn the volume down. I know this is, I know this is loud as hell. Music bumping though, I can't even lie. Some people be like, Gimmers, why are you playing Splunky 1 and not Splunky 2? Well, there's a reason. I barely have touched Splunky 2. Splunky crashed. I barely have touched Splunky 2. So I barely know anything about it. Splunky 2, you know, the way it was released kind of like was a big failure, in my opinion. They delayed like everything fun about it, aka the co-op. The only thing I look forward to about Splunky 2. 
I'm like a little squid. I feel like I modified my character at some point. Like I'm winning and made my own custom character. <laughs> yeah, let me record. I'm gonna record this too. All right, so we are here. Our goal is to kill the giant fish in Spelunky. The first one, not the second one. I know there is a giant fish in the second one, but again, no idea how to even get to that one. I barely have touched Spelunky too. So we're doing Spelunky one. Now, there's multiple ways that we could kill this giant fish. One of them being we literally go to the jungle and hope that we get the giant fish to spawn. Or we start from level one and work our way upwards. I, I think let's try. Just go straight to the jungle. Just to see. Hey, let me know if the audio is good in the chat. Just to see, like, if we get it to spawn. Yeah, I've done this video before. But obviously, it's before I had 300,000 subs. So, I got, like, zero views. So let's try it again. I bet, I bet we could kill this thing again. This thing gave me trouble. The first time I did this challenge, this motherfucker gave me trouble. This big giant fish gave me some troubles. Wait, are we on a water level? No, we're not. Okay. Oh, there's a crate in there, but there's fish in there too. If I could kill one of these fish. Oh. I could kill the other. Oh, he's a spunky god. Little did you guys know. Little did you guys know. Oh, never mind. I take it back. Excuse me. What the fuck? I took damage from that. Don't take out a bomb. Go, we're good. Yeah, I knew he'd jump into the spikes eventually. <laughs> nice. Good job, gamer. Thank you. I need to install uh, Stardew. <laughs> I installed a graveyard keeper. Which is like Stardew with dead people. <laughs> Damn, I forgot I had the baseball mitt. So yeah, we're, we're going through these levels and we're waiting for it to say, I hear rushing water. It'll say that at the bottom of the screen and that means that that's the big fish level. So if we don't get it in the next two levels, then, uh, oh well, we gotta restart. We gotta restart. Now the good thing about starting like from the very beginning, like in the cave levels, is that you got you get a chance to get like better loot to kill the fish. Oh god. I don't like that. That was scary. If that boomerang guy turned around and looked at me, bro, I was dead. I'm just trying to get to the end as fast as I can. No Minecraft intended. Yeah, Spelunky 2 launch was kind of booty cheeks. I think the Spelunky 2 devs are trying to hide that they had like a deal with PlayStation. They're like, we're coming out on PlayStation first. <laughs> it was just like all just dumb. And then they're like, oh, the multiplayer doesn't work. And then they released the game with no multiplayer. Then like a month, two months later, the multiplayer finally came out. And it's like, I don't really care about the game. Which sucks, because I, I've been waiting for it for a while. Wait, we didn't get a rushing water level? I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> no, we didn't. Okay, so we have to end the adventure. I mean, yeah, I know it's fun, but I have no reason to touch it. It's 
So like I, I don't remember how many attempts it took me in the original video. But it, it took me a while. It definitely took me a while. Splunky 2 is hard as shit compared to the first one. And the first one is kind of hard too. <laughs> like Splunky 2 when it first came out and I played it bro I was getting my ass beat. Like it was insane how much like more often I was getting my ass beat in Splunky 2 compared to 1. I beaten hell like two or three times in this game. And I beat hell with Jirachi and Ryan carrying both of them. Like literally carrying them. <laughs> I would pick them up like 90% of the time and just carry them around. I, put, I swear I played Splunky on the PS Vita. Yeah, it is on the PS Vita. PS Vita is like a high key underrated console. I, I want to pick one up eventually. Like people said about the Vita, it's ahead of its time. And it really is. Or it really was ahead of its time. Ow. Bro, Mago, you said the joke already, bro. Okay, I'm playing like shit right now. What the fuck I'm doing? Oh, what a play! Russian water. See, this is the this is the main reason why the challenge is hard. Not only is the fucking giant fish impossible to kill, but like you gotta get him to spawn too, and he just doesn't spawn half the time. The thing is, like, I don't know if I should restart the first jungle level over and over again, or if I should uh. Just play it out like this. Just speed run to the end. Oh, rushing water. All right, here we go. We get our first attempt. Our first attempt. Oh. See, like, I don't have any weapons. Oh, hold up. There's a shop down here, though. Eh. There's nothing good in that shop for this certain event. Please, can we stop taking my money? Thank you. I don't like the situation. <laughs> Finessed my way out of that one, huh? Finessed my way out of that one, huh? Uh, like, yeah, none of this I could really use against the fish, bro. Yeah, I said that, that the Splunky 2 has a big fish. great that I finally get to the level that it's on and then I fucking take two damage so I can't even like test anything big fish where are you it's usually like deep down there so like not only is it hard to find it's hard to kill it's hard to find on the level too it does a bunch of damage it's like bro there's so many things against you to kill this fish I don't even know what to do, to be honest. We just have to, like, go down there. There it is. This is the big ass fish. Ah! Ah! Come back, boomerang. Oh, what a kill. Oh, what a kill again. Game is a fucking maniac. Oh! Boomerang kill? Come here, big ass fish. Kind of hard to kill. <laughs> I was torn apart by the legendary river monster. See, at least it said legendary. At least I died in a legendary way. Look at that. Amazing. See, so yeah, I don't. I don't know what's easier. Like. We could get on the first level, right? Or the second level? 
I don't know if we can get on the first level. I bet if I restart enough, we would see. Will the music change up? I have not gotten a single event so far <laughs> from restarting. The music's bumping in this. <gasps> there we go. Poggers. All right, so the other best way we could kill this fish, given the supplies that we have, AKA my bombs and my ropes, is we just have to throw a bomb at it. on the bottom left is what it's looking like okay here it goes where are you big fish oh he's on the right he's on the right okay if I could just like it's gonna be tough oh we were close hey we hit him with some gems <laughs> oh, we should get. Oh shit. <gasps> Fuck. We unlocked a We unlocked a new character. <laughs> oh, get him. Get him. Get him. No. New character, hit him. I think the new character is dead. Wait, hold up. Okay, I don't think I landed that. And that was our last bomb too. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. I don't. I don't have any objects to throw. <laughs> Bro, I don't even know how much health this thing has. It's got to be close to death. What if I sit here and it like bounces my body around enough for it to die? I think it did die, but I'm not gonna count that as a kill. Obviously, I'm dead. But that's pretty funny that it actually bounced my body around enough for it to kill itself. <laughs> it's funny. I kind of want to watch the uh, original video. Just so you guys see how I killed it in the original video. But it's good to know that I could just restart over and over again. my mouse at my mouse like has a sleep mode and then sometimes when it goes to sleep it never wakes back up <laughs> like right now it, okay there you go it took a while let's watch the original video Okay, I typed in Spelunky and it just opened the first video on my channel. Why did it do that? There it is. Let's turn his music off. His music doesn't disappear when you alt tab. Alright. So this was done 2019. 2019. Hey yo, welcome back everybody to Spelunky. Same we intro pretty much. Back in action. You know, after we beat hell, I'm kind of just on a never ending high because I completed one of the hardest challenges in Spelunky. And that's obviously beating the game completely and not just to Olmec. But yeah, we're going to be doing a little something here if you can tell by the title and the thumbnail. Our goal today is to hunt down Obite which is the name of the big piranha and our goal is going to be to kill old bitey so let's see let's see if we can do it let's see if we can do it now i've only killed old bitey 
once or twice from what i remember one of those times i killed it with a teleporter i got a teleporter uh on the same floor as uh, old bitey and with that teleporter i was able that's how you to do it just telefrag old bitey which one shot him it that's how i want to do it and that's a that's a pretty good way to kill you know a giant fish so what is our plan here our plan is to just get lucky with rng honestly that's really it oh, are you fucking <laughs> kidding me all right on this floor game raiders moment game raiders moment oh, are you fucking kidding me all right on this floor i found the uh beehive but not old bitey now you can have old bitey please 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 please, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, we got a rushing water level. All right, so I just killed myself a bunch of times until we got it. Now, the real question is, how are we going to do this without, like, any good items? You know what I'm saying? Hold up. Shopkeeper? Really? Really? Come on, bro. That's a dog shit shop. That's what he has? Oh, my God. All right, we have a chance at least, though. Bring that over there. Oh, what control was I using? This shit loud as hell. How far can I? I don't know. I really don't know. We got to whip him, pick up the shotgun, and then... Oh, there's no way. There's no way. No. <laughs> there's no way. Oh my god. That's so upsetting. We got another rushing water level. Let's go. Let's go. That's what we need. Is that the black marker right here too? <laughs> it is. Oh, we have a shopkeeper too? See, the thing you guys don't get to see is the fucking 30 tries it takes me to find the rushing water level. That's the that's the fun part. Oh, I, I, I straight up don't know. Where? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, we have another chance. Another opportunity has arisen. Where is this big fish at? There she is. Yeah, there she is right there. When did we just drop a bomb? Of course not. It's going to drop that direction. Maybe we hit her with that. <laughs> Honestly? I have no idea. I... It's your brain, gamer. This would be my your brain. best bet. That's okay, not smart. That didn't even kill her. That would that should have killed god damn it. I want to see if I can sacrifice myself. Throw a rope up and then just jump. <laughs> we got a rushing water level. Bless up for this. Bro, I cracked myself up. I'm so funny. Oh my god, alright. There goes a heart. Okay, there goes another heart. Okay, alright. <gasps> we got rushing water. And we have a shotgun. And we have seven hearts. Damn. This has to be it. Okay. Just make her Oh my god. God, if I would have died because of him. We just talk about how that guy hit me off of the... Hit me from so far away. Almost ruined our run. I really want to use him to our advantage, though. This dude got hops, bro. This dude has hops. He's, he's killing a bunch of them, though. I cannot deny that he is helping. He is not helping. No, he is helping. Oh, my God. It's very terrifying when he gets up that high. Where's the big-ass fish at? Do that. No. That's oh a L. God, that was our best chance we had. I choked there. That was a choke. I didn't even get a shot off on her. This is our chance right Damn. here. Damn. Good bomb throws. That's Damn. That's two bomb hits. That's Damn. three bomb hits. Three bomb that hits and it's not hits. dead. Kill this. No. It's very sad watching that specific clip back because if I landed that first bomb, that would have been it. That would have been it. It takes four bombs to kill old buddy. That's so that means what? She has 20 health? 4, 8, 12. No, she has 16 health. Three bomb hits and I didn't kill her. That's honestly. That is sad to watch that. Where's it at? I know what you guys want to see. You want to see the end. And we've gotten close before with uh with our bo <laughs> no <laughs> see that's how you can tell that i've been <laughs> filming this for At too this, long uh, with our i'm over here whispering <laughs> no <laughs> Oh, at this point, you would think I'd given up. I have, honestly. But we have been given another chance here. First floor, <laughs> I think. And we have a freeze ray. And we have I'm a chat pack. Go insane. Now, I heard the freeze ray is pretty effective. Okay. So we're going to... We're just going to... We're just going <gasps> to... We did it! We did it! And we're going to live to tell the tale. Oh, my God. You guys don't understand how long I'm trying to do this. Oh my god, I can't believe 
We've actually done it. The madman. Known as game. Good job, game readers. It is doable. It drove me insane while doing it, but it is doable. <clears throat> Am I laughing at myself? Hell yeah, I'm laughing at my I laugh at myself all the time. I'm the funniest person. That I know. <laughs> now do it again. Technically, we already did it. <laughs> Technically, we already did do it again. It, the fish killed itself. The thing is here, let me look up. Spelunky 2 fish. Great hump head. This is the Spelunky 2 version. Waiting for the Empress to return and feed him. Spawns in the tide pool. 40 HP. How much did the old mighty have? Oh, it did have 40. Oh, bombs do 10 damage a hit. Okay. Damn, bombs are strong then. What the heck? And it does two contact HP. Look at that. They just reused the fucking literally same health and same damage. Everything's literally the same, except for it's a little bit bigger. It's five by three. This is large. This is huge. <laughs> if you hire someone to kill you, is that murder or suicide? It's murder. <laughs> no, it's suicide. You're not killing yourself. You're hiring someone to kill you, but you're not killing yourself. That's like, never mind, I'm not going to give another example. <laughs> I think I've explained enough. Great Humphead, what a greater name. Looking at the bottom of Tidepool's second level. So it's guaranteed at least. It's guaranteed at least. And then Tidepool, that's if you go to the right side. When you fight the first boss. Okay. Strategy. Humphead's surprisingly easy to kill even without weapons. Going near the entrance to shipwreck at the bottom right portion of the lake. Excalibur. What the fuck is Excalibur? They got Excalibur in this game. <laughs> so you know I should play more Splunky too. You know they had Excalibur bro. Do you plan on trolling Smith in Spelunky? What do you mean trolling him? I'm not gonna play Spelunky with him and troll him. <laughs> we already beat Spelunky together. Hey, shout out still for the Prime sub. What's Ryan doing? Is Ryan doing a uh, master mode? See, it's funny. Look at him. Look at him. Can the music stop playing? I closed the game. Splunky's literally closed and the music's still playing. I literally just closed Splunky. <laughs> I had to go into the task manager. Look at him. Look at goofy ass boy. So if you fulfill their happiness than just the teleport thing unlocks. I, okay, I get it. He's not going to do it. He thinks he's going to beat Master Mode. If you guys don't know, I told him I'd God, give him $250 if he beats Master Mode. He's not going to do it. Wow, look at all these. He's not going to do it. Level. He thinks he's going to do it. You guys want to see me like last time? Here, I'll show you guys. I'll show you guys what happened last time we played Terraria together. You guys want to see right here? Look at this. Not no. Where's the Moon Lord fight? All right, here we go. Oh. We now watch a montage of Ryan's death during the longest Moonlord fight. This, how long was this Moonlord fight? 
Did I post it somewhere? I swear I put it somewhere. That it was like a fucking like 15 minute Moon Lord fight or something. <laughs> okay. I don't know what side he's firing. Is it left? Yep. Right. Sorry. Right now. Okay, okay. Right. Die. Oh yeah, what a fucking juke. I like that DPS I'm seeing. <laughs> Look at the bottom I like left. The DPS I was seeing. I can't see what's hitting me. I I don't even know why I take damage, half the time. <laughs> just run, just run, just run, just run, just run. What the fuck? Oh my god. <laughs> Honestly, Ryan is carrying the fight. Yeah, and you're trying to finish off the fucking. Oh my carry. god, I can't. <laughs> I, I can't. can't. I. <laughs> I can't do anything. Keep in mind that I, I went tank. Ryan is our summoner. He does all the damage. I went tank. Obviously, to tank, pull aggro, you know, do all the dirty work while Ryan gets to do all the DPS. <laughs> and, like, I literally can't do damage. I can't kill the Moon Lord. Keep, some, keep in mind, the Moon Lord heals in uh, Expert, right? So the Moon Lord keeps on healing his health every time Ryan dies. I can't do damage. Get it. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't know what I'm getting hit by. I don't. I can't get close enough to whip him, or I just die. Like I don't think he's helping. It's annoying. Yeah, he's, he's, it he's hasn't. I know. <laughs> Come on, we're so close. If you could just Please. stay alive while you're fucking, you know, everything does damage. Ugh. It's a W. I, I can't. The lasers. I. I can't. <laughs> I don't understand how to dodge them. Taking hits. <sighs> oh. Well, like. Like I said, I, I even told him that pre-hard mode, master mode is fucking easy as shit. Like, pre-hard mode, master mode is way too easy, bro. The hardest thing is probably Wall of Flesh, and Wall of Flesh ain't even that hard. Because I beat Wall of Flesh with a fucking sentry turret. <laughs> with a ballista. Like, master mode, hard mode, that's when it really steps up. That's when, like, things start getting into my head in master mode, hard mode, bro. You play a master mode, hard mode, it doesn't matter like what armor you're rocking, you literally get two tap. Three tap every time. By everything. Oh I immediately get hit as I go in. Uh oh, this is bad. Oh, oh okay, I'm coming in, I'm coming in. I'm trying to take his aggro. Oh, okay. And alright. Almost dead, look at the health. Almost dead! Just you. He's, He's so dead. close to dying. I Did didn't even die? notice that he oh, died. I mean, <laughs> he didn't tell me. He died way up in the fucking he sky. Died. <laughs> we did it. I didn't really get to see much of the death animation, but we did it. Oh my god, that was a long fucking Moon Lord fight. Easy W. No, it wasn't that hard at all. Fog. Four. Has officially been crowned a terrorist <gasps> veteran. I'm a veteran. <laughs> About. He was. Enjoyed. If you like my former content, then you'll probably. Right. But he thinks he could do it. I definitely, I give him the uh, bravado. I don't know. Was that, what does that word mean? I definitely give him respect for thinking that he's going to do it. And he said himself that he's enjoying the game. So that's good to, that's good to hear. But, like, I think once he gets to, uh, once he gets to hard mode, that's when it's really going to, he's going to see that he might have bit off more than he can chew. Is that, can I make anything of that? Of course not. And he gets to play any class he wants to. He doesn't get to play summoner. <laughs> or he doesn't have to play summoner. Also, during that Moon Lord fight in the noob and veteran thing, I don't think I died a single time. Because <laughs> I think if I died once, we would have lost. There were some close moments, though, where I almost died. But I give it up to him. He's going to do it. Well, he's going to get far before he thinks uh, he can't do it. Why do you think I even put money on the line? Because I expected him to not be able to get through it. <laughs> so if he gets through it. That's 250 out of my pocket. He's not getting he's not getting a Christmas present. <laughs> Alright, what the fuck do you guys want me to do? What do I do? Do I just end stream? Do I just host Ryan? He's playing Terraria. 
My bad. I, I really didn't know the boulder thing was going to be that bad. I thought it was going to be a fun challenge, but like it legit was did not go how I expected the boulder shit to go. Which kind of sucks because I wanted to do a stream today. I wanted to actually do a stream. But I don't have a backup challenge ready. I'll, I want to set one up later on. All right. Y'all, yeah, I'll host Ryan. Everyone call him Goofy. <laughs> Everyone call him Goofy. Watch him play Master Mode. I'll be in chat probably. Also, join the raid. Get some free Casimir coins because I know you guys are broke from the summoner streams. Minecraft summoner. I actually might work on that. I actually might work on that like legit after I end this stream. Work on that Ender Dragon episode. So next stream, we can go to the end. Tap in, tap in. Join the raid, everybody. Join the raid. I know you need the Casimir coins. All right. Thank you, everyone, for coming. Again, my bad for the stream. This is my fault. I should have tested the boulder mod itself. Uh, we'll be back maybe tomorrow. Maybe I'll stream tomorrow just to make up for it. I'll see you all tomorrow.